And all Orlando theme parks are closed tonight. And for only the second time in Disney history, Central Florida's largest theme park is closed. Local 6 reporter Louis Bolden has the story from Disney. Um, I'm petrified. I think it's awful. I, I can't believe that a plane went into the World Trade Center. We're the news spread quickly. The fun and fanfare came to a halt at Walt Disney World Resort, and the fastest moving ride was the stream of cars exiting the park as Disney closed its doors. We made the decision this morning as a precautionary measure. Um, as you know, we put the safety and the security of our guests and our cast as our highest priority. About 200,000 guests were ushered out of the park. Within an hour and a half, parking lots were empty. Tourists from around the world were shook up. I'm in shock. It's, I'm nervous and I have the chills. And Those tourists from New York City were desperate to end their vacation, desperate to get in touch with their family members back home. My concerns are for my family. My uncle works in the World Trade Center. So I don't even know what to do right now. Others say being at the park just didn't feel right. And what some call the happiest place in the world seemed to have a cloud over it. Unbelievable. That's exactly it. Unbelievable. Can't believe it. Can't believe it. It's just such a tragedy. It's, it's, just, like... it's just not real. Not real. Nancy Puckett has been to Disney World twice. Both times, the only times in history, the park was closed. But after coming back this time and Disney World being closed a second time that I'm here, I don't know if I ever want to come back again.